Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. Thank you so much for being here. Hit that like and subscribe if you haven't already. Today we're just going to learn about the spiritual and medicinal uses of ladies slipper, which I'm borrowing from the herbal tarot here and tapping into the knowledge of Michael Tierra and Candace Canton from their Spirit of the Herbs book that it goes with this deck. And lady slippers paired up with the Queen of Swords. I love it. <laughs> All right, for those that would like to grow Lady Slipper and you happen to be in a hardiness zone conducive for it, um, in agricultural texts, it may be listed under its Latin name. So I'm going to give you that, okay? And I will spell it because it's rather complicated. Cypripedium pubescens. Okay. Spelled C-Y-P-R-I-P-E-D-I-U-M. First word. Second word. P-U-B-E-S-C-E-N-S, -E -E okay? The spiritual properties of lady slipper. This beautiful herb creates within us a deeper connection to the earth, alleviating imbalance and nervousness that can manifest when we are opening ourselves to new channels of thought. It also induces calmness and clarity when working with this type of inspiration. Medicinal properties. Lady's slipper relaxes the nerves, calms spasms, relieves pain and hysteria, and induces rest. It clears depression and affects a calm, cheerful state of mind. It is considered a nerve food and can be taken up to three times a day to help build a healthier nervous system. Interesting. I know they do make tea out of it, okay? You can probably find that over the counter too, or probably at least on Amazon. Dose or preparation, due to its extensive use over the last century, the lady slipper is an endangered species. Like a wood nymph or spirit, it wilts and dies when taken from its natural habitat. Thus, it's very difficult to cultivate, okay? When preparing lady slipper, use it with the most utmost respect and with no waste. A standard decoction can be made with it and taken two or three times a day, or a tincture can be taken 10 to 30 drops at a time. Okay. An herbal essence would be quite effective to help induce the feelings of having your feet on the ground and your mind calm and clear, especially when doing work that entails much mental visioning and detail. Carrying Lady Slipper in a pouch will transmit her magical qualities of peacefulness and joy. Meditations with this card, so if you would like to screenshot that, you're welcome to, um, or with a picture of the herb can have wonderful results. Okay. The herbal allies for ladies slipper are lavender flowers and calamus. Okay. There you go, guys. Hopefully that helps. Have a good one. Bye.